The second main category of UML diagrams is the behavioral diagrams. In contrast with the structural diagrams, which describe the system as a whole, the behavioral diagrams are concerned with a particular instance of behavior of that system. That is, you may have to have multiple sequence diagrams, multiple collaboration diagrams to convey the given idea of overall system behavior. We're going to now survey these so you get a feel for what's available to you. Once again, it's unlikely that for a given system you'll use all of these diagram types.